Jordan. Yeah. How you doing, everybody? Good. Okay. Well, what do you think? I like it. I like it a lot. I put a bunch of rounds on the steel, about 200 uh, through the uh, paper targets. Okay. And uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. The zero, as far as you can see, the zero remained zero the entire time. Is that correct? Yeah, absolutely. Good. So 200 rounds about down range yeah. and uh, good consistent zero hold. Outstanding. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Thanks a lot no, for uh, running the test for us. Yeah, you're not getting it back, so. Well, you know, that's good because we were going <laughs> to give it to you for your efforts anyways, but uh, you've certainly earned it. No, I appreciate it. It oh. really was a lot of fun. Okay, good. Thanks a lot, right. Jordan. Hit it! Derek, what I did here is the vast majority of these shots were accomplished using the laser. Uh, on some of the shots, I just reverted back to mechanical because, as you know, what we're doing is taking this pistol, the X400, we're putting it through its paces. So what I wanted to see is I used a lot of laser on this thing, and then a couple times I reverted back just to make sure. Just basically what I'm doing is reaffirming the zero. Is the zero still holding? Yes, it is. Okay, obviously with the laser, it makes it a lot easier. I don't have to pick up the mechanical sights. I'm not worried about... Uh, I'm not worried about a horizontal and vertical aspect sure. relative to one another. I'm just coming on. I've got the dot right about here for most of these runs, and this is about 9.5 miles an hour, so you can see that coming in here, I'm just focusing. I still have a solid firing platform. I'm still leaning into it. I'm doing all the good techniques, engaging right. moving targets, and a lot of fluidity in my motion and everything else, and I'm tracking with them a good follow-through, but I'm simply using the, depending on which direction this guy's going, I'm taking the laser, and I'm putting it right about here, and this is where I'm obtaining most of my hits center mass, good. so this one I kind of punched out. Let me see if I got it right here. You got the white light. You're able to deny your opponent if it's mm -hmm. an opponent, a threat. You're able to deny them the vision to be able to precisely see where you're at. So that's an advantage. You're able to clearly identify whether it's a threat or Correct. a friendly. And you're able to use the light laser for a very fast uh, sighting device on a moving target. That's correct. Good. And well, so it's proved it's worth on this. Well, let's try it with a rifle real quick. There part. it is. Okay, let's do it. Hit it. Again. And again. This guy's going about nine and a half miles an hour. Uh, working up very quickly, shouldering, good stock weld, both eyes open, point of aim, point of impact. So I don't have to offset at this distance. Normally I would. But I use optics, mechanical sights, I'd have to offset. I'm putting, you can see, in the, in the basically in your uh, vertical aspect, exactly where I, I had point of aim, point of impact. And this just all leads in how smooth I was. You want to try this? Yeah, if you don't mind, I'd Absolutely. like to, like to, to work it. the pistol okay. out a little bit. And... Again, hit it. Again. Stay on him, hold. Again. And holster, good job. All right, brother, let's go forward and see how you did. Okay. Pretty good group, look at this, right in there. Um, this one is actually a hard shot because this is when you really, really extend it out there, so you got this guy going away from you. Yeah, so, so you're that's, not, a, that's an angled yeah, shot. Yeah, it's probably about 12, 13 yards away by the time you hit this, but look at this, you know, shots are right in there, you're on the, okay, and good. again, where were you, you know, where were you holding the laser? Uh, much kind of in here. You know, I was basically uh, holding just off of uh, center mass yeah. with the laser at that speed. Right. I mean, the, the laser makes it so much easier. I think it would have had half the round count out if I was using iron sights. Just the, mm -hmm. the time to index the sights, line them up, have that confidence, and then start the trigger squeeze. I'd say and, you know, I was able to execute that action twice as fast. Well, it's a good tool. You know, one of the things I talked about before, that 125, you kind of disbelieve me, we're going to try it. It's a very, very challenging shot. Target is rather indistinguished, but 125 yards at night, and uh, you said you couldn't do it. I think there's a strong possibility you can, so. Well, I got lucky in the daylight with a 125-yard target, but I hate to talk myself out of it. Okay, let's try I it. don't think there's any way, though. But I think uh, you can. So I'm going to okay. use our new M3LT and the X400 light. All right. Uh, we'll give it the old Rogers Surefire. Okay. Possibly one o'clock, about a foot. Yes! Bingo. Okay, I got it now. Outstanding. Oh, please. <laughs>
We actually stopped earlier today before we got up to the Eagle's Nest to, to film the intro to this, uh, to this video. That our mission was to get Scotty Reitz's stamp of approval on the X400. So tell me, how do we do? Uh, fantastic. Great, Great piece of equipment. Uh, it's hardened. Uh, again, like all the Surefire products, very well made. A lot of innovation that's gone into this. Um, definitely pushing to the forefront of uh, research. You guys have always done that. Um, always been a pleasure, you know, working with your equipment. Uh, the thing that I really like about it, it's a hardened system. It locks into the pistol. The laser is, you know, real innovative. And now we've got that dedicated to the light. The lumen output is much greater. You could see that. It was readily apparent and very, very clear delineation on the moving target when I came across that. Uh, the nice thing is having that laser, which is dedicated to the light, and it also coexists with the uh, mechanical sight. So it's a great, great tool, uh, fantastic piece of equipment, and uh, I really enjoyed it. And, uh, and always good to see you again, young man. So Likewise, likewise. Okay. Uh, All right. Let's pack it up and go home. I think so. Thanks, Scott. All right. See you later.